I have a box here that was brought to me earlier today by my friend uh, Barry Gilalbert. Um, he often finds stuff and uh, brings it to me, and quite a lot of it has become a part of my collection. I'm going to do an unboxing video. I've not opened this box. As far as I know, Bill didn't either. And um, all I know, uh, all he told me is that it is uh, Christmas ornaments of some sort. Okay, so it could be old antique ornaments, it could be newer stuff, I don't know. But uh, let's take a look, okay? Okay, I got down here on the floor a little bit closer. This hasn't been sealed with tape or anything, but again, I haven't opened it until now. So whatever we find in here, you're getting to see it with me first. <clears throat> As, I mean, I don't know if there's anything exciting in here or not. Uh, pulling out here, it's a scan of Snow White Mica Flakes. Uh, that we used to use to decorate instead of the spray that's out nowadays um, we used this and it was a lot prettier a lot sparklier this was only 25 cents when it was sold so I'm thinking it was even before uh, maybe my time which I was born in 1955 but I can't say for sure let's move on what do you have here ah, here is a polar bear ornament and he feels like whoa <laughs> He feels like glass to me. He didn't shatter just then. Um, I don't think he's plastic. I think he's actually glass. Nice ornament. I don't see any maker's mark on him or anything. But still, a pretty cool ornament indeed. Um, well, let's continue to dig in. Um, here's a box of... Uh, they look like you know pretty plain ornaments to me. I guess maybe the most interesting thing about this is the... Uh, box itself with the original graphics um, it only originally it only cost what is it <laughs> five cents for the box of 12 shiny bright ornaments and a nice vintage box okay here we have a an old shoe box inside there what are these that, all right that's not Christmassy neither is that nor that, nor that, but they are pretty cool. They're made out of plaster to hang up. They all are, uh, have a rich uh, bronze, gold, coppery color. Very cool, very cool indeed. I, I'm, as far as age on them, probably the 19th. Okay, let's return to the shoe box, which I see here is Santa Claus made of, of material. He's not real old, he is heavy, he's cute. Um, very much a country looking snowman um, I'm thinking he's probably in the 80s or 90s and another snowman in here he had something he was holding in his hand here that's missing probably a broom um, he looks like paper mache but he's not I believe he's some kind of poured resin there is no maker mark on this little guy he's pretty cute shall we dig further let's um, in this box we have um, ba -da -bum. It's plain gold ornaments. The box is generic. I mean, it's what they came in, but it doesn't have any um, interesting markings on it. It says Harshaw, is all. I'll have to check on the brand. Harshaw might have been, you know, a, a really good brand at one time. Um, took a puff on my cigarette, sorry. And let's go to this one next. This one large ornaments in it, but they're all, you know, one color, they're all shiny. The the box is the main thing here, the vintage box, the Santa Claus over there up on the rooftop, up on the chimney, and then over by my thumb, a uh, Christmas tree. These are, um, manufactured them, Fantasia brand, it says, Fantasia brand. I'm looking to see if there's a price anywhere here in the box. If there is not, I would place that in the 1950s. The box is really cool. The ornaments are nice, but they're nothing right home about. Now this box, as I am just looking here, has what looks like it will be some interesting ornaments. This box, I don't think these are the ornaments that were originally in it, but um, bear with me while I get the top off the mirror pit. I'm going to have to pause this for a second, folks. Just Nice job there. If you have to see that, I just dropped the camera. I'm sorry about that, folks. 
Um, it's probably... Anyways, I was showing you this glass ornament here. It says, You're Our Hero, and 75 with uh, what looks like... I thought it might be a wedding ornament for a wedding or for an anniversary, but it doesn't have anything on it that would really indicate that. Notice how the, even the hook is hand blown. Okay. This one strikes me right off the bat. Let's take a closer look at this piece. Oh, wow, that's heavy, very heavy. It feels like metal, but looking through it, now you can see through it so it's not metal, it is extremely heavy glass that has uh, Merry Christmas etched into the glass here. And I just spin it around. I don't know if you can see them roll or not. Very nicely etched snowflakes into it. Let's look at the top here. That says on the top, Midwest Kugel or Kugel. And I happen to know a little bit about that, uh, their ornaments. They were very expensive ornaments and they are still expensive ornaments. Some of them very highly collectible. I like the shape of that too. It's an unusual shape. So um, I'm thinking that this probably could be a 50 or $60 piece. Awesome nice, awesome nice. And then here's a, a red ornament hand painted around the, the, I mean, you know, the color. The white is hand painted around it, I'm sure. That could have been machine done. Mm, this has markings on the top also, which says, um, well mark, um, um, hallmark. Excuse me, Hallmark. Okay, Hallmark. I, I doubt that it's the Hallmark card company. This interests me a lot. I'm going to have to look that one up. Very, very cool indeed. One more box in here. And this is a, again, it's a shiny bright box. I, I don't know if all the ornaments in here are shiny bright ornaments. I'm thinking probably the full color ones are. Here is one that's really cool. This was hand painted. I'm thinking this one goes back to the 20s or 30s. 1920s or 1930s. Very nice piece. Very nice. Pretty. No no indication as to who made it, but it is uh, definitely probably the oldest piece I've seen in here. Silver with red splotches. That's an older piece too. Probably not as old as the one I just showed you. Although the top looks very similar. Eh, not quite really. And then this one here, all color is faded off from it, but it's an older ornament too. Notice the top. It's hand blown glass. I would like to know what, you know, what had been on it. But then the rest here is, uh, you know, they're just pretty common um, Christmas ornaments. Well, that's it. I hope that you enjoyed this. I enjoyed it. I had fun. And I'm going to have fun looking this one up. I'll do a follow up video at some point and tell you what I find might be the value on that piece. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great night and God bless.